Hello! Welcome to Wednesday, May the 6th. Yes, Wednesday, May the 6th. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Uh, so glad you could join us, join me. Click on my face, because there are some weird faces I've noticed as I look through the, the list, because now this is number 30, I think, that I'm going to be recording. My face is like this, and like this, and like like there's like all these crazy things happening with my face. It's like, oh, yay. Anyways, <laughs> welcome to Wednesday. So uh, it is Canadian Mental Health Week, besides the fact that it was May the 4th. And uh, yeah, all kinds of things are happening this week. Uh, it's like kind of snowballing and getting faster and faster. It is also Canadian Mental Health Week. Uh, you may have heard things on the radio uh, about Mental Health Week. What is mental health? I'm not going to get into this whole long conversation about mental health, but what we do, if you've been tuning in with me every day, that's your mental health. Uh, it's, it's things that make you smile. Hopefully I make you smile. Um, things that you enjoy, things. So think of the things that like you like to do kind of thing. Um, I know I like to read. I like to take walks. I like to listen to music. So all kinds of things that you need to do to take a break and the, all those breathing things that we do. So we've been taking, like talking about the take four, right? I talked to you about take four. So, uh, breathing in for four. Let's try it. Hold for four. Let it go for four. Hold for four, right? And taking those as many times as you need. Uh, sometimes just doing that, like what we usually end our videos with, like stretching our arms out, wrap our arms around ourselves, right? So just sometimes you kind of need to give yourself a no, your own hug. Since I can't hug anybody, I hug myself uh, and my family. Uh, talking about like how we would do the, the four, the breathing four on here, right? So breathing in for four. Breathe in up for four. In. Out. Right? Those kind of things. Uh, also the breathing ball. Right? So breathing in. Out. The uh, singing bowl. Let's see if she sings today. So put a happy thought in your head. Something that makes you smile. Something that makes you happy. Okay. Oh, where is she? There she is. Let's see if we can get her sign. She's funny. Sometimes she sings, sometimes she doesn't. And it's interesting. Don't know why. Uh, but yeah, we do our own mental health things and doing art, doing, uh, you know, sometimes taking a break. So I came up with a bingo card for you. It looks something like this. <laughs> Let me see if I can get there. Click share. You are now sharing your screen. You're presenting your screen. So I went to this website and, um, it was all about, here. let me go back a couple, uh, created my own mental health bingo card and I created all these different things. So let's go to what it looks like. It's like this. Um, and it says things like, think of three things that make you smile, sit in the sun. But I put a little disclaimer and said, use sunscreen. I don't want you guys burning out there. Uh, hang out with your friends. Ooh, let's put that. I'm going to edit that. Hang out with your friends online. <laughs> because <laughs> you can't really hang out with your friends yet, or unless you're like six feet apart distance. Uh, play a game or a puzzle, talk to a teacher or counselor, take three deep breaths, perform a random act of kindness, write a positive letter to yourself, do some yoga. I do yoga every morning. Sometimes I'm not so much on Saturday and Sunday, but every day. Uh, exercise, eat something healthy, go for a bike ride, free space, write or draw in a journal, listen to music, sleep, get lots of sleep. Really, honestly, I know uh, that is huge, getting lots of sleep. Uh, talking to your parents, dance, pick up garbage or make a spot beautiful, make and use a stress ball. What I meant by that is like you could take a balloon and if you fill it with sand or rice, sometimes like like just scris like <laughs> that kind of helps, right? Uh, going for a walk, drawing or painting, make a healthy snack and share it, 
watch a funny movie, and hug a family member. So if you go, I'm going to send you a link. It'll be something like this. Um, it'll be some weird combination of letters. Uh, and I will copy, I'll put that in the front of the video. And if you go to that, it'll give you something that looks like this. Yeah. And you can actually like click on them. Right? Like you could click on the, the squares, you can unclick them, or you can even like print it off. Um, what I did uh, is I went control P, right? And then I could print it. Uh, it only gives you about a half page. So remember that when you're printing it off, it's kind of print small. It's just the way it is. It's an online thing, but it was really hard. To, I'm like, how am I going to do this for you guys online? That's just not going to work. Uh, so let's cancel, 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 cancel. So I want you guys to try and get like a line. Oh, keep that one on there. Get a line either horizontally, vertically, diagonally this week, today. Hopefully you can get like at least a line. Come on, you can get a line today, I'm sure. And then maybe we could get like either an X or a frame, like a box, and then try and fill in the whole thing by the end of May. How many days is that? Off. Oh, it's the May 6th. You got lots of time. So, uh, yeah, see if you can, and if you do get a line, take a picture of it and send it to me at Sheila Byer at PWP SD.ca. <laughs> yeah, whatever. Okay, let me stop sharing. Stop sharing. Go here. Cool. So, mental health week. Now, I wanted to talk to you about the rocks. Oh my gosh, you guys. I have been picking up rocks on my walks. Like, I've got, like, rocks and rocks and rocks. And um, me, I'm always kind of go towards these ovally, circly um, ones. Uh, so I wanted to do, show you how some, like, I have tons of things to show you with rock painting. I looked it up. Oh, I could do this. Da, da, da. <laughs> um, I have lots of things to show you. Let me... Should now I'm presented because now I gotta present again. Ay, 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 ay. Click on that, click on that, share. Um, where is it sharing? Just about. So, oh, okay. If you follow me on Pinterest, if you go to my page, I have one that's just called Painted Rocks, and this is what I have in my painted rocks. Like, I have like I love trees. I don't know if you guys know about me, but I have trees. I have like stuff that you can write on. This looks like Snoopy. Like, there's, there's like you know, the words we've been writing on, and and this has got like the same kind of look i love this one this is like um sophia in grade five she made one that looks like an egg and it's, it's like keep your sunny side up isn't that awesome i love that uh i love these little birdie guys it's be kind be nice and this is just like little those little dandelions you know when the dandelions they're starting to grow and then they're gonna seed out and you like yeah and today's a day and there's flowers and there's hearts and there's rainbows and there's so there's all kinds of stuff like you look on pinterest crazy what you can find so i clicked on this one uh creative top painting techniques perfect for kids and beginners yeah it's not bad um but look at all this stuff down here like there is wow like what you can do with rocks look at the bird like just crazy amounts of stuff that you can do with rocks so i was going to do one today with you guys just to show you very simply what i'm going to do stop presenting uh so look down here i took my rock i painted it black Oh, yeah, this is what the mental health bingo looks like. It's we'll put up a page. So you could, like, print it off and, like, like I say, do a line, vertically, diagonally, all that kind of stuff. Um, but let's do, let's get that rock. Can I, I don't think I can even zoom. Let's go like that. Uh, here's paints. Um, I'm using all kinds of paint brushes, but I'm using the ends of them, the bottoms. You could also use... Uh, where's my pencil, 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 pencil? Hi, this whole classroom has no pencils. I got pencils you could use, right? Uh, I'm gonna do keep it fairly, fairly simple. Kiss theory, but I like circles and I like how they go round and round. So, what I'm gonna do first is I'm going to where's that pencil? I had a pencil. That was one, two. Just, 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 that makes sense. I want to use. Oh, because they're both weird pencils. Hold on. Let me just reach over. There we go. Okay. Uh, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to take... Oh, there's the pencil. Under the paper. Oh, you guys, the desk is still a mess. Um, 
I'm going to put some light lines on here. So I'm going to go a line vertically. I'm going to go a line horizontally. I'm going to go a line through that, like almost like making snowflakes. And I don't know how well you can see it. You know, I kind of got those lines in there. What I like about that is it kind of gives me a place to put stuff, right? Uh, so I'm going to put one big dot in the middle and I'm going to kind of do the rainbow thing. So I'm going to go with my biggest uh, paintbrush bottom and I'm going to just dab it into the red and I'm going to go in the middle. Right? So there's my first dot. Oh man, it's blurry. Why is that so blurry? Yikes. I don't really like how blurry that is. Sorry guys. Uh, and then I'm going to wipe that off. And then I'm going to go around. Oh, I should have white paint. Hold that thought. Let me get some white paint. Because I like making little dots all the way around um, those circles. So I've got some, and I use, I'm using acrylic. I'm using acrylic paint. If you guys need paint again, let me know. I can give you paint. Uh, so I'm just going to go with a little bit of white paint. And I'm going to, now the, I find this very uh, relaxing, like very um, meditative, like very, uh, I like it. So then I'm just going to go around, oh, see I made a mistake away, around my circle. I'm just going into the paint. And if you make a mistake, it's okay. I can put that there. I can always cover that up after. trying to get close but not touch the red and I know it doesn't have to be perfect okay so there's my white I'm just gonna wipe that end and then I'm gonna go with um, orange oh I went those too big I think but that's okay I'm gonna go on my orange I'm gonna go around and typically I want you to go like dot in dot around, dot in, like dot into the paint, go around, dot, right, like it's just sometimes easier. Oh, that one touched, that's okay. It's just fun to play around with. It's very, I find this very relaxing. Some people might not. I'm not sure. This is not how I intended this to go. Why did I have those lines there if I wasn't going to actually follow them? <laughs> Funny. Uh, and then I'm going to go with red, orange, yellow. So then I'm going to go on all the, these ones I made. These lines. And you can pretty much do anything you want. I like circles, uh, I like uh, hearts, but it's kind of up to you what you're gonna do. Okay. And then I'm just gonna go with the tip. I'm gonna go into the white. I'm just gonna make some like dots around the yellow. I don't know because there's just different sizes. There's all kinds of things you can do, right? Um, so this is, I'm not gonna keep going because I could just keep doing this for like hours and hours and hours and hours. Uh, so I find this very meditative, but uh, I'll show you guys what it looks like tomorrow. Um, but this is another thing that you could do for Mental Health Week, okay? So just doing some dot art. Uh, yeah, so that's what I got going on today. <laughs> Gotta get rid of that one little spot. Um, yeah, so collecting your rock, and I'm gonna do all those different kinds, like those different, like I, like I'll, I'll have, if you like I say, if you follow me on Pinterest, um, oh, I guess you can't see that, but there's I've, like there's lots. Ton, you look up on Pinterest, there's tons of ways to paint rocks. There's no wrong way. So that's one thing I want you to know. However you paint your rock is not wrong. Right? So I'm, I'm painting this because I want to finish it and I'm going to hide this one somewhere in Claremont. Um, but yeah, I just wanted to 
say that that's another thing for mental health week that's that's something that you might want to try again if you need paints let me know so i'm just thinking my head's all kind of like uh yeah maybe i should breathe okay so let's put our arms out big stretch head back big inhale exhale give yourself a big hug hang in hang in there guys so grateful for you guys for watching cross stretch those arms out again cross it the other way awesome oh my god you can't hear me because i really hard to tell so i'll do that instead uh again grateful 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 so much gratitude that you guys are watching um sharing some stuff i'm going to try and do some indigenous stuff i'm going to try and do something every week with the seven sacred teachings trying that either tomorrow or thursday um yeah so be safe think of your mental health you always have your breath no matter what no matter where you are remember that you always have your breath you can always just like take four or inhale three times right just two more times Let those shoulders drop one more time. You're not alone. And it's okay. Everything that you feel um, right now is okay. You, you're not supposed to be feeling bad. It's okay if you're feeling good. It's okay if you're feeling bad. Like it's everything is okay. It's honest. I promise. It's it's okay. Uh, you're not alone. So, oh. The good that yeah take pictures of the bingo thing if you get that worked on download it or i'll give you the link i'll share the link at the beginning of the video so miss you guys uh you'll see me tomorrow i'll have the rock kind of done not exactly how i thought that was going to go but that's what happens uh and i'll talk to you guys later okay i will sign off now bye